If government wants to reduce poverty, youth unemployment and crime, there is the need to channel the energies of the youthful population to industrialization and agriculture. These form the major submission of speakers at the training session organized by the Yoruba Professionals Foundation and Ilano Omo Odua. Speaking during the training, a retired professor of romantics and comparative literature, Ade Kukoi, who represented the leader of the IOO, Professor Banji Akintoye, urged the younger generation to keep on with the battle of industrialization as the future belongs to them. Founder and president of the YPF, Maxwell Adeleye, said, hunger, starvation and poverty are breed insecurity and civil unrest. Adeleye said the aim is to use science, technology and digital innovation to wage the war against poverty in the land. This should be your moment, this should be your time. And never mind all the, uh, what we call, distractions. And there are many distractions in place. But be assured of one thing, most of all, I believe, and that's what we are discussing just before we started the meeting, that is, this is the right moment. And you must find yourselves, you must be ready to hold your head. We want Yoruba people to embrace commerce and industrialization, and the best way is through entrepreneurship. Our aim is to see a Yoruba land where jobs upon jobs will be created. The Nigerian government has refused to create jobs for our people, so we felt we should help ourselves. We should be our own, we should build a, 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 our own China. We should be our, build our own Japan. We should build our own Germany, our own Malaysia. So, and this is the beginning. It's one to use what they have. Because it's one to learn something, it's another to apply it, and another to make money out of it. Because uh, they say technology is the application of science. Eh? But then you can apply science and get technology. If you're not creative or resourceful, you might not be able to make money out of it. Respondent, a cross-section of the trainees thank the organizers for the life-changing opportunity. Because I have a lot of project I've run for people and I don't know how to produce paint. I had to go and meet people to produce for me in which one way or the other they've, all my profits has gone to them. So this is a privilege and a valuable privilege for me. It's like a one in a million opportunity for me to go out into the world of men and make my own way too. I really want to thank them. I also want to thank Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.